Well, hello everybody. This is Street Outlaws No Prep Talk. Today we're going to talk about Robin Roberts unveiling the new Hearts Turbo Centrifugal Supercharger yesterday at PRI. Now, but we're going to go directly to their photo owners. Please subscribe and comment and stay tuned for a lot more videos coming. All about the Street Outlaws No Prep Kings Ray series and all the other Street Outlaw shows. I do apologize if you hear some music in the background. I am attending a wedding at the hotel and they're doing a sound check. So, hey. I still got to do a video. So, yesterday, with some surprising news, Hearts Turbo, which is a very, very common turbo manufacturer now on No Prep Kings, basically unveiled their new centrifugal supercharger. Very similar, at least in size, to a Pro Charger. Yesterday's release has a 140 millimeter compressor wheel which is pretty similar to the pro charger f4x 140 size so they're pretty much making something that's going to compete with that pro charger blower now there also will be an 136 millimeter compressor centrifugal supercharger now we don't know specific details about the blower because they really haven't tested it much but from what i hear they will start testing it next week now how does this come into the street outlaw snow prep kings world well robin roberts has already said that he is debating on switching power adders on his new car build he is building a new car and he wasn't unhappy with the turbos. In fact, he really liked the Hearts turbos, but they do have a disadvantage against the Pro Charger cars on NPK. They run a bit lighter, even though they could change the weight rules this next season, but they also create more downforce, making the cars easier to tune and also a lot more consistent down the racetrack. So, Raman was having some issues with consistency with the twin turbo setup and with hearts turbo actually coming out with a billet centrifugal supercharger that promises to be more efficient than the uh, pro chargers centrifugal superchargers maybe he will be running this unit next year after they do some testing with it i'm sure now this new blower is supposed to be a lot more efficient than what the pro charger blowers are and honestly the vortex centrifugal superchargers in my opinion for their size are the most efficient centrifugal blowers out there pro chargers are not the most efficient but they pretty much make the most power because they're a lot bigger than the vortex blowers so if hearts can make a blower more efficient than the pro chargers and actually run at the same size, it's going to get very, very interesting. 